I remember the first time I put my hands on the piano and having the reaction like a shot of electricity almost. But it was like, there it is, now I'm complete. You go first. I should go first? Yeah. Well, it was at the old Manhattan School of Music, mm -hmm. East 103rd Street. And I had nothing in particular to do, and Ron was sitting in a corner when I came into the lounge basically to sort of kill time or chill. It, it's funny because had I been thinking, he Tarzan, me Jane, <laughs> <laughs> or something like that, I would have probably just left the room <laughs> because I would have been shy to open up that kind of a conversation with a guy, <laughs> you know. So at some point I just looked at him and I said, what you doing? And the rest is history. Ram's mother said... Yes, yeah, she, she said, Romolo, quando ti deve mettere a posto? In other words, get off your butt and <laughs> ask this girl to marry you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yep, yep. And that's the way it started. That's the way it started. Linda was studying with a uh, wonderful pianist piano teacher at the Manhattan School of Music called Ida Hermans. We were married and so on. And Ida at one point says to her, Now Linda, make sure you don't get pregnant. Right away. And right away. And Linda said, well, now that you mention it. <laughs> and what apparently happened was that became the joke of the school because it became my middle name because the teachers meetings what they started doing was they would refer to me as Linda Kessler now that you mention it very <laughs> He so. did strange things. One day he was on his way to school, <clears throat> and I said, your underwear, overwear, socks, and shorts are, you know, I just said, oh, underwear, overwear, socks, and shorts are on your bed, because he was getting dressed. And uh, the next thing I know, he's walking around the house, and he was pretty young at the time, and he's, <laughs> he's singing, underwear, overwear, socks, and shorts. Underwear, overwear, socks, and shorts. <laughs> underwear, overwear. <laughs> You know, these, he has perfect pitch, too. And um, he's just, he's a beautiful guy. And he's a terrific scat singer. So we have a lot of fun. somebody in your life who really can understand you and the guy I'm sitting next to here for over 50 years we cry at the same things we laugh at the same things and we struggle uh, between us and with the same things yeah, it's been uh, quite a time